Hello, it's me, Jimmy O. I'm in the lair of Carboot Kev. We're here to talk about Laughs at the Lion. It's a comedy night, a one-off for one night only, kids, at the Golden Lion. And that's a Saturday the 20th of April. You've got me on, Wild Wayne, as seen on TV, Carboot Kev, as seen on Family on Inley Carboot, and Barry Meaden as well, basically. We're going to give you a night of comedy and stuff like that and, uh, with the Carboot Kevin. Hello and welcome to the laughs here at the Lion. I hope you all come. It's going to be a great night. Please all turn up. It's we need the money. I've bought a Jaguar. I can't afford fucking run it. I'll be truthful with you. They won't give me a crisis loan. The fridge is broke. Turn that fucking music down. It's too fucking loud. Basically though, if you don't want to come to the comedy night, it's okay. But we've got loads of shit in Kabuki. Kev. We've got these kids. Turn that music down. It's fucking doing me head in. But these, these are 8 track cartridges, right? Now these, can you see it? This is from this was from the 70s. It was like, we're gonna be like, take on from tape. It was basically the iPod of its day, wasn't it? Well, that yeah. was like the iPod of its day. It Perry Como, mm. a good artist. None of this fucking Nicki Minaj who's into the Illuminati with their fucking all seeing eye symbols all over the fucking place and all that. You've got Jerry Le- Lee Lewis. Now he liked to fuck young girls, but fair play to him. If, if he wanted to marry his 13-year-old cousin, it's nothing to do with us, really, is it? You know what yeah. I mean? And he could play the piano, by the way. He didn't play to the tune like Les Dawson. He could really play the piano. <laughs> and he had great balls of fire, so I believe. Also, we've got some fake grapes. Basically, they're not really, they're not real. You could buy these, and if there's some fat kid in your street who you don't like, you say, here, you eat these, and watch him, like, choke, and... You know, that, it might be just, oh, you've got a variety of colours basically. You've got the green grapes. But the, um, and the thing I found today, apart from these lovely time pieces, you know, the Swiss watches he's got. This is a matchbox, it's not, it looks like a matchbox car, but it's not. We've, we've basically turned this film into a, an advert from a comedy night into an episode of fucking Flog It. He's also selling fucking. Plectrums, how much are you selling these for? Oh, they're at least 40 pence each. Them. 40 that's pence each, that's not too bad that actually. But I'm well impressed with these. These are 8 track cartridges kids. You know, I, when I was young they had these. But uh, like I said, it is the iPod of its day. But I bet there was something these Kev, you know. It will be. You know. This little car, it's... Show all oh, we forgot, show them. Oh, the, the show, show them the mate, show, show them, go on. This is actually a cigarette lighter, did you see it then, light? Show them the pièce de résistance, go and get it, go and get it now, you, you wait till you see this, this is amazing, this will change your life, you know, but if you're not interested in all this shit of two bored middle-aged men, like I said, there's a golden lion, 20th of April, you come down and just say hello, if you don't like me, come down and fill me in, you know, basically, that's it. <laughs> He's here now, he's bringing this... Right. Now look, look at this. Now this little gadget, actually, it's a, it's an ordinary pen, but really it's a radio. I pinched it off one of Piers Brosnan's sidekicks when he was just off the Basically, stage. it's trying to say you got it from Q off James Bond. It's a pen with a radio in, you know. So when you go signing on, you could be listening to Shawaddy Waddy with your pen, or if you're really depressed, you could, like I am at the minute, I am depressed beneath all this fucking shit, um, you could listen to on Radio 4 medical programmes while you write your own fucking suicide note, listen, can they hear? Yeah. Can you hear that, listeners? What are you listening to, what is this? Glenn Miller. Glenn Miller? Well, there's nothing wrong with that, but that's it, we have eight track cartridges, Imaginary grapes, a, a radio pen, <laughs> and an evening of fucking comedy. Now, we do apologise, you know, it's not Swindle Labour Club. There's no fucking meat raffle. And, you know, it, it's not medieval, it's slightly more progressive than that, you know. So you won't be going home with a Hessian sack full of infected fucking BSE lamb chops and all that fucking rubbish. The dirty animalistic bastards. No, we've got uh, we've got snacks on. It, have we? <laughs> yeah, we have. We've you got, can bring your own yeah. crisp. Yeah. But nothing against you bringing your own crisp. We've got uh, 
Sugar scratchings on and red rum scratchings are a good flavour as well. Nothing wrong with that. Basically, you know, it's laughs at the lion and that's Saturday the 20th of April. Come down and say hello. Good night. Good night, Kev. Good night to all. God bless. Thank you very much.